Guys, today is our moving day. <laughs> you know what's crazy? We never actually showed you our, our house together. So we're gonna give you a quick tour today. This is your door. There's one bedroom, obviously all of our stuff is here. All the stuff we're gonna bring to the new home. Good toilet. And kitchen. And our living room. It's so much nicer when all of our stuff was there. The guinea pigs. This is our toilet. And this is our bedroom. This was like our first home to go in here, obviously. Change is good. Change is very, very good. We've got to move all of our stuff. We'll probably take about two or three trips, but the good thing is, it's like five minute drive. So, We'll see you guys there. She's still cleaning. Look at her. Such a strong girl. <laughs> this girl's been cleaning the whole day. Well, not the whole day, but she's been like scrubbing everything. And look how many poos they've done. <laughs> we're cleaning, we're going. Guys, come on. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we've finished cleaning. We've moved everything out. We're doing our last load and we've just returned our keys. I'm actually feeling a little bit sad because it was where Giuseppe and I first met and all of our first memories here. And we've had so many great parties here with our friends. So a little bit sentimental and emotional, but... Yeah, but this is our first time properly moving in together, so new it's, chapters. it's really good. New chapter, but We've look literally how literally cleaned everything. Look how empty our living room is, and we're gonna really miss that garden. And now we're just quickly cleaning the floor and everything. Here's Giuseppe with our Uncle Mick, <laughs> super strong, piling it into the super van. We fit so much stuff. <laughs> so much. Whoa. <laughs> I don't know how many trips we're going to be doing I'm tired man I'm so tired And guys we're in This isn't the final This isn't the final like look of the house But um, yeah we've bought our old sofa Which I carried Six flight of stairs by myself Isn't that right baby? Totally <laughs> <laughs> She's still there. But yeah, once we so put everything. We're happy that we finally got ourselves in. I'll show you what the bedroom looks like. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, once it's all done, we'll give you guys a proper house tour. So, our lovely agent put a little bottle of Prosecco in our fridge that we're going to crack open because you know what? Pop that baby over. We deserve it. Pop that baby open. And we've basically, well, it was hilarious because um, we broke our TV unit. So now we're using these little bedside tables that we're selling instead. That's okay. Yeah, and we're going to get a new sofa. <laughs> and we're going to get a new thingy, my Bobby, because that broke as well. Yeah. <laughs> And here I am. Hello. I look crazy. I'm just ironing the sheets right now. So we have our lovely um, bed ready of made. But we're literally mostly finished. I need to get a new hutch for the guinea pig. So this is their temporary setup. Hello, Sissy. <clears throat> Hi, Moo. Cookie's there. <laughs> Giuseppe made this and then do 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 so we basically we just need to unpack all of our clothes and shoes and yeah that is so cute a little flat and we're so excited mm. oh my gosh every single <laughs> time I put the camera to you you have been yawning we've done so much the past couple of days we have done so much we're about to watch that mo this movie where is it and yeah let's pop this sucker open found some glasses which was handy by the way guys at the end of last year Giuseppe literally chopped all my hair off because basically last summer I dyed my hair blue which I love but Nick could never get the color out and now it's grown so long because I have really curly hair and I haven't um, put heat on it 
or done anything like straightened it or anything in like over like a year and so it's grown so much it's like here now so i'm really happy okay one two three are you gonna get in then <laughs> what I'm talking about. We love wine over here. Let's make a toast. Toast of new beginnings and our new house. Toast. <laughs> Yay. A toast to you guys. Hi hey guys. guys. We hope you enjoyed our little miniature moving in vlog and we'll put up another video when we have everything sorted. We're still waiting on a little bit of furniture and whatnot. Um, but today we are carving pumpkins. I have actually never carved a pumpkin before. Have Just you? let you know, guys, my one here is a bit. Ooh, <laughs> it's a bit the soft. One. I got the rotten one, so we're just gonna have to show you this. There. I've never carved a pumpkin before. Have you? Look at my pumpkin. <laughs> um, yeah, and I'm really good at it. I'm gonna cut like carve like two evil eyes and then a mouth of spiky teeth i actually don't know i actually don't have a plan now i'm starting to freak out thinking that i should have done a little bit of research and i've got all the knives here for us so <laughs> we're gonna get this party started and we've got a time limit of 10 minutes that is not gonna happen i'm gonna put a timer on for 20 minutes i never even use the timer how do i do it oh yeah I'm uh, 20 minutes. Shotgun is the best knife. On your marks, get set, go. I'm gonna get a pencil. Where is the pencil? I need to find the pencil. Oh. Can't find the pencil. Just gonna improvise. <laughs> <laughs> Line up. Don't look at mine. Don't look at mine. Don't get any it's ideas. It's going to be a surprise. Don't get it's any hard. ideas. This is really hard. Don't point it near me. What do you mean? I feel like you're going to get it in and just like cut. Yeah, well, how are you supposed Once you do the cuts, how are you supposed to get it out? Oh, I see. You can just. Oh, do not trust myself around sharp objects. I'm actually lucky I still have all my fingers. Can you be careful? I keep feeling like you're going to go. Chuk, chuk. Ooh. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> I am an absolute whiz at this! How much have you got out? I'm doing an outline of mine because mine requires skill. I've done the perfect triangle. I don't know if you guys can see, but this is my line. My. Oh, you can't see. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's disgusting. Oh, I just put my finger in it. Oh, I just put my finger in the moldy part. Oh. Uh, I just felt my finger like smudging it. Stop looking at mine. Mine is so good. I'll do it again. <laughs> oh. What should I name my pumpkin? Be careful with that knife. Can you move up, please, to your side? Move up to your side. There's what a line. What do you mean? Time for the big boy. You got the big boy? <laughs> yes. Now we get this one. I can't believe this is my first time carving a pumpkin. Wait, ever? I don't think in New Zealand we really like do Halloween. I guess some people do. I mean, I did go trick or treating and stuff, but it's not like I don't think people carve pumpkins there. Oh, <laughs> or maybe oh my, I messed up. Or maybe my family no, was just never like. No, I did. No, I did. No, I did. No, I did. <laughs>
to give you guys a little sneak peek. Okay, well, there's 11 minutes and I'm pretty much done. I'm just emptying my pumpkin now, which is actually quite hard work. And then gonna do a little bit of final touches and then, I don't know guys, I feel like I have this one in the bag. I've pleasantly surprised myself. Oh my gosh, how are you supposed to get all the stringy bits out? I'm just going in with my hands. Ugh. It's like a weird, it's gross, but also like really satisfying. Like Ooh. We're gonna make, you know we're gonna, we should roast all of those and eat them as snacks. Yeah, your phone's covered in pumpkin. Pumpkin. What was that noise? No one break go! <laughs> no, because I've got one bit like hanging on by a thread. A literal pumpkin thread. I can't wait to be a dad. My dad? I can't wait to be a dad. I think I can't wait to be a dad. Pumpkin, pumpkin, pumpkin! I do love my mind. Oh, you... You... Oh, you Oh, my eye fell out. Oh. Okay, I finished my pumpkin. Um, but while Giuseppe finishes his pumpkin, wait, first, let me, let's update you on what we've got going on in our life right now. So... We moved apartment, which is great. We were staying at a two bedroom, but we've downsized because basically we're trying to save for um, a house at some point, which is exciting. Um, we're loving the new flat. The only thing is we have this enormous balcony, which is great, um, but it's so cold, so we probably won't even use it until next summer. So it's kind of like wasted space at the moment, isn't it? So we've got that going on. What else is happening? Um, it's my birthday next week, which is exciting. We are going to a place called St. Ives, which is in Cornwall. It's known for its like really, really beautiful little cobble street lanes, obviously the beautiful beaches, nice little boutique shops and good places to eat. So we're really looking forward to it. Just getting out of the city, I love being by the ocean, so just waking up and being able to walk along the beach. <coughs> coming at you. <coughs> I would say bless you, but you're already blessed by me. <gasps> so, see you guys back. Four, three, two, one. Okay, wait, don't show me, don't show me, don't show me, don't show me, don't show me. We're going to turn all the lights off, and then we need to put... A candle inside to light it. Oh my gosh, you haven't even cut the top off. That's what I'm saying. We had a 20 minute timer. Well, I wasn't in that 20 minute timer. <laughs> what? I was, if you see mine, you'll be like, oh, that's why. Because it's so good. We had a 20 minute timer. Guys, when you see, you're going to be like. I already win by default because you didn't follow the game rules. You just said carve the pumpkin. You didn't really say, you know, put, take the you guts out. You wanted to do the, a 10 minute timer. So are we ready to show them what? Because I'm pretty excited to show my. Well, but we have to do the lights in the in them. Oh my god! Okay, cool. Oh, so gross! Oh, oh, it's so wet. Oh, mine is disgusting. Mine is so soft on that side. Look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why is it? Get... Uh! Oh, no, that's disgusting. No, you know, I like to see. 
Oh no, your one smells like um. Oh no, stop. <laughs> You're the one who got me this. Where did you get this from? It wasn't like that when I picked it up the other day. Oh, I really don't even want to imagine what it looks like inside. No, it won't be anything inside. <laughs> what? Okay, this is the big reveal. Go, you show yours. Oh shit, that is. Three, two, one. Oh. Yours looks pretty cool. They're like a shark. Cool, right? Is yours? No, mine's a scary Halloween pumpkin. You thought yours quite with good. Scary shark teeth. Let me see yours. Yours is quite good. That's what I say. I pleasantly surprised myself because I didn't think I'd be very good because I hadn't done it before. But I just went with it. I believed in myself, and this is him. And what should oh, I call mine is, it? Mine is. Like mushing in my hand and leaking. I feel like, what shall I name him? Mine looks mm. Arab. Mine looks. What? What do you think we should name mine? Terry? No, but mine can be called Moldy. <laughs> I I'm going to call mine. Mine is. I don't care. Mine is. Look at my teeth. Guys, come up with a name for my pumpkin because I can't think. Yeah, guys. Think of names in, in the comment section. I'm thinking like a Terry or a Barry or... I don't know. I can't... Oh, look I, at this. I'm look, look, usually look, quite good with names. Look good. Oh, I'm, I'm just putting... Bleh. Um. So, yes. So uh, these are guys, mine's kids, falling apart. Look. And I am going to put a candle in mine, but we'll probably have to chuck yours because yours is foul. But we'll keep mine. We can put it by the door. It's so cute. Yay! Yay for Terry! Okay guys, comment below who you think won the pumpkin carving competition. Me, Gigi, or this guy, Giuseppe? Let us know. His name's Moldy. Woo! I'm not aren't, you supposed to, aren't you supposed to cut it though? You totally cheated by just carving it. No, but that's, that's the skill of carving. I guarantee you, you wouldn't be able to have done it. That's why mine took a lot of time. I reckon um, she should go as Delma, Velma, from Scooby-Doo. I think you would look so good. What, the girl with the orange hair? Yeah. So that orange, like this, in orange, and then your red orange skirt, and then your orange... You would look oh, and you could... so... And you just wear the glasses. You would look so good. And you could go as Shaggy. As a dog. Shaggy? Raggy? <laughs> Raggy? Raggy. No, really? Really? The boys. There's the tall blonde guy, yeah, and then that's, there's that's Shaggy in Scooby Doo. No, there's a tall blonde guy, like Shaggy. the hot guy, and then oh. there's the guy who's always with the dog. Have you got a thing for Shaggy. cartoons? I used to think that the tall blonde guy on Scooby Doo was so cute. <laughs> it was the same girl who wore um, the purple. She was so pretty, and then the one with Velma. She was like the nerdy one, wasn't she? Yeah, you would suit Velma because you've got your short hair now and then you wear the orange, you look just like Velma. Daphne. Daphne. She was like the hot one. Mm. And then Velma was like you the little wear, cute you nerdy one. You wear this one in orange and then your orange thing. And then I'll... You could go as Shaggy or you could go as Fred Jones. This is the guy that I was talking about, Fred Jones. He was the one that was like the cute, cool one. And he was like the cute, cool one with... Um, Daphne. No, but what I'm saying is you would pull off um, Velma so well. You, you want me to go out like that? I no, 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 no. You would wear this, but in orange, and then like a red orange skirt, and then orange tights. Yeah, high we could socks. do that actually. And then Shaggy was the stoner. Well, we didn't know that as kids, but now we know as we're older that all he ever did was talk <laughs> to his dog and, and have the munchies 24-7. <laughs> and we're like, what's wrong with this guy? No, what about Scooby, what about Scooby-Doo's nephew though, the baby? Oh snap, I forgot the small one. Yeah, what was he and he was always causing trouble. He was trouble. annoying, he was so oh, annoying. Oh, it's Lil Scrappy. Scrappy. <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Scooby-Doo was so such she's basically, a So she's basically telling me to go as a dog for Halloween. Do you know how insulting that is? I told you to go as Shaggy, not Scooby-Doo. Shaggy's the stoner guy. You know what? When you watch um, 
cartoons as an adult, you realise all the sexual references and stuff in them, don't you? It's not even a sexual references, it's just... But there's all kinds just, of inappropriate stuff. Like they're inappropriate. When I, I went and saw um, the new Adam's Family movie last week, and don't ask me why. Did you? Yes, I told you. It was so weird. And I was just like, what is going oh on? God. It ended with like one person that was half octopus, and then one person that was half goat, half chicken. And it was just like really bizarre. And I was like, the only Adams Family that I remember is the one with like actual real people in it. Oh wait, so what's the new Adams Family? It's all animated. So I wasn't a fan. Wasn't a fan of that. What's your favourite animated movie? Your favourite cartoon? Um, I can't really think of one on top of my head because... I think mine's Shrek. I love the Shrek movies. Oh, I like all the Disney movies. Finding Nemo. Oh yeah, Finding Nemo. You classic. What else is there? Um, Finding Nemo. I used to like that one. Ants. It's a bug life. Oh, Ants. Ants is such a good film. Bugs Life is such a good film. What about the, the ones where it's like all the fish under the water and they go through the car wash thing? I want a car wash. Yeah, what's that, what's that movie oh, called? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shark Tale. Oh, yeah, Shark Tale. I love Shark that Tale movie. Cool. Wait. But I actually can't believe you Oh, see Stuart Little. I loved that movie, The Little Mouse. Yeah, Stuart Little's pretty cool. Um, you make me want to watch Disney movies now. I know. The thing is, is there are so many good ones. I know there's a lot of crap so cartoons, many, so but many. they're so good. But I also think they used to be a lot better. Yeah, back then, definitely. Wait, now I'm actually like... just going to look up best animated movies, because what have we got going on here? Oh, we're doing the See, chipmunk. I... Yeah, I remember the chipmunk, that's but that's... Pretty, that's quite new. I'm talking yeah. about like late 90s, early 2000s. OG ones. Yeah. Comment down below oh, if you're Flint... a 90s baby. Flintstones. Oh, that's very old. Oh, you've got Aladdin, Pocahontas, The Little Mermaid. Oh, I do like the Ice Age. Yeah, Ice Age is pretty cool. Ice Age ones. What else have you got? Oh, The Incredibles. The Incredibles. Yeah, the Incredibles. That's definitely a favourite. These ones are all like new ones. I don't really know. Madagascar. Yeah, that is a good one. I guess Toy it's Story. really funny. <gasps> Toy Story and Hello, Lion King. How did oh, you miss that up, one off Lion the list? King. Another movie I used to love, actually still do love, Monsters Inc. Oh, Monsters Inc was so cool. I and the little girl was that like, movie. that girl was so cute. And they were just the so cool. What was that other one? And it's like, um, oh, a new movie that is good though is Sing. I like that one. Anyway, now that we've discussed all of that. Right. So we guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. We really enjoyed making our beautiful mouldy pumpkins named Mouldy. And oh, it's leaking in my hand. So put it down. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to our also channel. Also guys, comment down below what you, you, what you guys are going to dress up as Halloween. We want to know. I want to get ideas too. Maybe you guys can tell us what you think would suit us. Yeah, what do you think? I really that we think you would as? dress up as Velma. So, yeah, guys, make sure you guys comment down what you guys think we should dress up as Halloween and what you guys are going to be dressing up as Halloween. We really want to know. Our next YouTube video will probably be my birthday vlog. So, we'll put that up hopefully in a couple well. of weeks. And our little See adventure to Cornwall. So, we love you guys. Thank you for the support as always. <laughs>